It's a month-long celebration. We've learned a little history. We've talked about civil rights. The entire celebration culminates with a festival and parade. And here to tell us all about it is Francine Beppu, who's with the Legacy Foundation, and Joe Bach, the co-chair of the parade. Thank you guys for being here. Appreciate it. Thanks for a having me. A familiar yeah, face. Thank you for having <laughs> me. Familiar face. Thank you, Joe, for being of here. Of course. Glad to I, be. I, you know, I know that she's a, she's a character, but uh, I'm uh -huh. glad to have you back. Thanks. Love the hair. Thank you so much. And the robe. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just trying to get in the spirit. We're trying to catch up. We haven't seen yes. each other for a while. All right, could you give, give us a little background about the uh, on the nonprofit organization? As um, I, as I understand, the Honolulu Pride is a project of the Hawaii LGBT Legacy Foundation. That's correct. Yeah. So the foundation has been around as a nonprofit since 2008. Okay. Um, and our mission really is to empower, educate, and support all of the LGBTQ community uh, here on the island and statewide. Um, to, to that, when we support all the different organizations that are around um, with the use of our center, the LGBT Center Waikiki, mm -hmm. Honolulu Pride is our, our big, um, you know, kind of awareness campaign, mm -hmm. uh, the parade and the festival, and then we have other educational programs uh, throughout the year. There's a lot that goes into all of this. I, I, I want you to tell our viewers what they can expect to see this weekend. A lot of color. Yeah? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Mostly right here on the couch with Francine. <laughs> This is just a sneak peek. Um, I mean, it is the most colorful parade. Mm -hmm. Now one of the largest parades in the state. So, you know, come out, enjoy, participate. Um, there's going to be uh, festival entertainers. What's new this year uh, at Waikiki? Well, what we're really excited about is, um, you know, last year we had about 105 units. This year we're close to 150. Um, our festival uh, following the parade will be held at Waikiki Shell. And new this year is a big family and kid-friendly Ohana area on the lawn right there. So there's something for everybody to enjoy. This really. it's a fun event. Uh, we were a part of it last year. We got to be on the, the Alaska Airlines float. Uh, it's it is is a great time for a, a lot of people, but it also means a lot, doesn't it? It does. It's really a chance for the everybody in the community to come together uh, to be visible, um, to be out and proud, and kind of just be a part of the community. Um, we're all about diversity, and it's really a chance for everyone to really show their colors. Um, I know that you have the pride, uh, yeah. a lot, lot of color there. Yes, <laughs> this is a uh, pride guide. Um, it has a full list of events and entertainers. Um, so, yeah, there's a lot going on. If somebody doesn't have that, where can they go to find out more information? Is there a website? There is a website, HonoluluPride.com. Um, and these uh, pride guides are available at LGBT-friendly venues mm -hmm. around town. Perfect. Thank you guys mm -hmm. so much for being here. Of, of course, course uh, there's, there's sponsors that we want to thank. There's donors that, that, that I'm sure that you guys would love to thank because there are quite a bit. And they're, and they're listed here on the bottom. Yes. It, it, it really takes a village to put this yes. whole event on. So we really want to thank all of our volunteers, especially because they're mm -hmm. hard work, uh, and all of our sponsors who really help us. You know, we have our visionary sponsors, Alaska Airlines, Hawaiian Airlines, uh, Hula's Bar and Lay Stand, Hawaii Tourism Authority, Bank of Hawaii. Um, Highgate and Sheraton Waikiki. Don't forget it. Of course, K2N too. Of course, k -2 Yes, yes, yes. Uh, and, yes. And of course, we're going to continue uh, the, a look at the various LGBT resources all this week on Living 808. And don't forget the big uh, parade and festival coming up this Saturday. Be sure to watch it. And if you can't get down there, that's okay because, like they said, k 2 is going to be streaming it live at 11 a.m. on k 2com and Mikey Moniz will be there to, uh, to, to bring you along throughout the festivities. Coverage begins at 11 a.m. And it's brought to you by our friends at Alaska Airlines and the Recovery Law Center, Hawaii Surrogacy Center, and Lavender Center and Clinic. Thank you guys so much for being here. Thank you for Thank having me.